Hello everybody, welcome back to PlayStation Doom Reloaded, 100% Wolfu on Object Islands. So Today we are playing Map 22, Hell's Foundry. This is take two, because the first time I tried this yesterday, it turned out that my microphone wasn't recording. And I was very strict on time, that's why I was kind of rushing around, I didn't even notice that my mic was muted. So anyway, we're going to do this again, luckily it wasn't a blind playthrough. So anyway, we could have four shotgunners behind us, that's why you want to take out that cacao from a distance. Well, this is now the second to last hell level. And then we're going back to, well we're actually going to a new area, but we're going pretty much to Earth. Lots of cool surprises there, but I'll get to them later. Anyway, so we're going to walk here, there's going to be another lift with two pinkies on it. This guy's in the diet. Almost, mate, almost. I'm actually to come back here and get this guy's shotgun. Right, let's go this way. There's going to be three shotgunners waiting for us. And here's the third one. And there's going to be some goodies in there if you need them. When we grab this blue key, some Lost Souls and Caco Demon will come from here. I think there might only be one. And the other Caco Demon's this side with a bunch of pinkies. So let's, um, let's get these guys. Hey, he somehow bit me. It's best to come over here because I don't think these Lost Souls can actually get over here. But they never seem to make it. See, I think they're stuck over there. So this is definitely the best side to take out first. Take him out, and there we go. And we'll be back here quite a bit later on, but for now we're going to go this way. So there's um, 74, 71 enemies on this level and only one secret, which we won't be getting to the end of this map. So we're now going to come this way, kill the shotgunner, and go down there where there'll be another attack of demon. I think the second one woke up, which is below us. Damn it, I walked straight into that. Yep, here he comes. Let's just use the chain gun real quick. Nice. He just jumped straight in the way, which is good. Right, we want to go down there, but there's going to be a few more guys we can take out. There's going to be a Kakadim that's going to wake up behind us as well. And I think I'm going to take him out from here, if he wants to play, because I've already cleared these guys out and I don't want to come back here. Oh, hi. Where did he come from? Okay, yeah, there's a couple of lost souls over there as well. Ideally, I don't need to come here, so if... It'd be good if I can kill these guys now, if not they're going to come here and get stuck somewhere and I'll have to backtrack to this bit. Nice, okay that worked. So that'll take us back here actually. But now we're going to go the other way. I do not think I need the box of shells. There's going to be three pinkies waiting for us. And there's going to be a shotgun on the, on the right side. He's going to be hiding around that corner so just be careful of him. Trying to be sneaky. Down here, we don't have many rockets, but I'm going to use it anyway to kill this Baron down this long hallway. There he goes. This is actually a backtracker, so we can't do nothing there yet. And when we step on this um, elevator, we're going to have pinkies either side of us. So be ready to clear one of them out. Next area, I'm going to run right past everyone and I'm going to use the BFG, because there's a whole group of guys we can kill here. See if we can get as many grouped up together. Oh my god, he fell off. It wouldn't matter if I'd fallen off, it just means I'd have to backtrack the area I didn't want to backtrack through. Nice, that works. Works well enough anyway. So we grab the system, this is where you find the rocket launcher and some ammo for it. On the map if your pistol started. Although it is actually quite difficult to get to this area if your pistol starting because of all them guys. So there's going to be another we'll pinky here. And a few more guys around this corner. This is the way we need to go to get the uh, red key. We already have the blue key, which is needed for the exit. Okay, so when we walk, we need to walk off here. And when we do that, whoop, a bit too soon. Walking off the wrong edge. It's this corner over here. There we go. So this is the way we need to go to get the red key. It's kind of tricky to find. I mean, I know you've got that little texture clue here, like the bottom floor there, it's a different texture. But it can be a little tricky to find that, so if you didn't know, that's how you would get the red key here. And now we come up there, and I said that was the backtracker. Now we've got to backtrack a little way anyway, through here. 
Um, no, I'm coming back this way later as well because we need to backtrack one more time for the secret. So I'm going to leave them shelter later. Uh, so you want to walk over here. This will activate the secret. Should I waste a few more rockets because we get plenty on the next level? And there we go. If all's gone well, there should only be one enemy left. Nice. And there's no wandering cacos or nothing to that raise. Now we can jump down here. And that little platform that we would stand on where I said um, no is a secret, we'll open up this door with the BFG in it. Okay, we're going to go and grab them box of shells on the way back now. See, you have to backtrack a couple of times. I think if you do go the lava way, it could be a little quicker. But you, you end up taking damage. About 100% health, so I don't want to waste that. I think there's much health from this point on. Maybe a stim pack or two somewhere. Oh, there is a couple of stim packs this side. So anyway, in the exit room, no, I'm a spectre. He's not going to bite me. Nice. And we should be done. Yep, 100%. That is Hell's Foundry. Yes, it is one of the last Hell levels now. It's the last proper Hell level. The next one's a boss fight. If you know how the original PlayStation Doom works, then you know what level's coming next. So yeah, this level's not too difficult. It's, it's um, You have a lot of pinkies on this level, which use a lot of ammo if your pistol's starting, and you kind of have to prioritise which enemies to kill at first. But apart from that, I think this is a nice laid-back level. Nice easy one to um, just bruise through. There's not many um, areas that are too difficult. So the only area I think that probably you can get overwhelmed on is the area of the rocket launcher where you have a huge group of pinkies and a couple of cacodemons. But apart from that, it should be a nice smooth sailing ride basically. So in the next episode we'll be playing map 23, one way ticket. Until then, I'll see you guys in the next episode. Goodbye.